All right, so 13 minutes to go, Mr. Duff. All right, who do you want to pick first? Um, I know that Infinity is really strong. So is God or Funk. So is Massive Head Wound. The best is pretty good too. Infinity's got to face themselves. Yeah, I was looking at Infinity and Abyss in the top right corner. That's possibility. Yeah. It's being trumpeted on my server. Awesome. Like I said, I have 600 trumpets on one of my servers. <laughs> A little much? Hello, Guardian. Nine minutes to go. I'm just going to get my charger so I don't die here.
Where is everyone, Naomi? Doorbell. A little pop up. Probably Naomi. That makes no, no, it was because you and your brother were beating up on her, and she would come visit me because she was like, "Get me out of my house." <laughs> so she would come over the fence, and then I would bring you in, and then you would play upon her. But then you were just having a bad day or something, and he was just a six-month-old baby. <laughs> <laughs> Whack the baby. A typical two-year-old, you know, um, reaction to. Everyone's beating up on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is great. Thank you. Uh -huh. That photo, by the way, it's such a fun photo. Yeah. So, yeah, this is the wall that you're, you're not supposed to see. You need a lot of renos at your place. Mm -hmm. We got the experience doing that. Yeah. Oh. Thank you. Okay, now. So, we'll just call her. Just call her. Just lots of insulation, usually. Yeah. No, we're very good. We were just, we got Connor and Connor's on China. What? Yeah, he's doing um, 
part of his university at UCLA. Wow. Wow. Corresponding university in China. Um, so he was connected there. So he was the principal. This is in Hong Kong or Beijing? No, or? it's in Yemen. Yeah, Yemen. Yeah, 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 it's a southern province, province in China. Yeah. Somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> and so he got a long flight to Beijing and he's got 24 hours and hello. <laughs> Oh, you can't. Oh, your house, Ollie. Um, 24 hours in uh, Beijing. Oh, my gosh. We've had a student. No, he's Spencer. We actually dragged it out. Well. He's got friends in Beijing. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. So dragged it out a little more. Yeah, so I can get up. It's better than six hours. Hi. Oh. How are you? <laughs> I don't know if you remember who we are, but to work in safety, he's all over. He's just. Just chilling. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so then he goes off to the university and he's there for August and possibly longer. Mm -hmm. Is it the last word to come over or to work in the other schedule? I think he can take semester or that semester off because he's doing a summer semester. Uh, but that's the only one he can take off. Well, Jacob works for Hilo first, and he works at um, West Fortune. But he's from the end of the Oh, no, really? Where is he? Is he sleeping? Probably. He can't really go out of the house. He got slide tackled by our own player. Here we go. Yeah, I'm up. Is it a bad break or is it like ready to go? Yes, yeah, he has a bad break. Well, that's something, I guess. Yeah. And are you waiting there or? So I'm watching the top right match. Yeah, it's an interesting start. Hello? Oh, yeah. What's the dog doing in here? <laughs> Who's that? It's Oliver. <laughs> Ollie, come here. Yeah. Ollie, come here. <laughs> Get that away from me. I'm allergic to dogs. Smart girl. She's quite talented at it. You should show them your dresses. That's better. Away from the noise. Okay, I'm away from the noise. I'm fine now. We should hop down to uh, the back cave so we don't bug these guys. Alright. So there's the cane in the bottom lane there. You're watching the same match as me? Yeah, I'm watching the same one. Looks like the team, uh, the red team's running the anti push layout. There goes the cane with a crit on the smite. I'm surprised about that. But there's three freaking priests. Good luck. Bit of an odd setup. Three priests and a ranger versus three mages and a warrior.
you don't see that too often. No. Clean break. That lion roar doing value. Ooh, godlike angelic savior. You don't see that too often. Yeah. No, you don't see very many of those either. And uh, I was just telling those people in the chat that for every 10 people in here, I can give away 500 gold. So the more trumpets, the better. There's a petrify on that angelic flame. I'm giving it to uh, the bread team right now. What are you thinking? Definitely have a strong start. The Artemis doing a lot of work though. Just yeah, wrecking yeah. line war. <laughs> well, Artemis and Valen just wrecking house. Valen with the double crit, I think. Is that right? Yeah, he uh, took out both uh, Kane and uh, Lion Roar. Which is pretty impressive. Very. And then he's going to take out the uh, own oh, Nether Crit. The Healer White. So the blue team's done a good job of just cleaning the board up a bit. I always find it strange how prevalent of a target that um, what's her face is uh, that summons the bats. Lady Neferetta. Oh yeah, yeah. She uh, she tends to gather a lot of attention. Interesting godlike got, set. Like, uh, set. I have to say, it's a very nice card. Yeah, was it like a triple knockback? Yes. That awakened uh, rebel is not a joke either. Six minutes in here and not a distinct advantage for either side, although the Odin is kind of scary. Godlike world and the godlike Callista have on the blue side. What's your preference, Set or Artemis? Um, that's a good question. They both have they both have their um, advantages. A really godlike set is just beyond good. I think it's really an under underrated card. I don't even think I have an epic set. I think I combined my godlike set last week. Damn! I didn't know you had one. Yeah, I just well, I just got it, and then uh, yesterday I combined a Dante, a Dante. Dante is fantastic. Don't you diss that card? Don't you dare? I'm not. I'm not. I I I, I use it now since it's you know gives two health to everything. Wow, that's the first time I've seen an awakened Alvin Frost sorcerer. That thing's a piece of trash. Whoa. Thirty-one four, thirty-four one, Ralph. 
That's brutal. Well, I guess the uh, the Elven Frost Sorcerer doing eleven damage is not 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 terrible. <laughs> put her put her in conjunction with the world, and I bet she can be pretty beastly. Yeah, I would say so. Red team pushing real hard here. Yeah, that, making a good push again. 34-4, smash your vault, no joke. They haven't, haven't put an answer up yet for that rebel that's marching through. Uh, Lumineers will take care of it, right? Right? <sighs> that three armor. Yeah. It's, uh, it's a tank and a half. Well, they do have the eight, the Oracle Priestess with the um, Heavenly Help on it, so. So the Alvin's going to do 11 damage to the El... The, sorry, the Frost Sorcerer is going to do 11 damage to the Elven Rebel, but then it's going to get reduced by 5, so it's going to do 6 damage. Is that how it works? But if, it depends on how many buffs or debuffs the Elven Rebel has. I thought it was if like nimble armor and resistance. I thought those were effects. No. No, well they're not. They're 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 just natural effects. They're oh, their abilities. Uh, okay. Debuffs or buff. Yeah. All right, gotcha. So it's only going to do five damage, and then it's going to reduce by five. And it can't freeze it or yeah, slow it or whatever it does. So. Yeah, might as well just hit, you know, Desperate Soul. I'm not going to get anything out of it. Oh, was that a call? What was that? Armageddon. Okay. I I left the screen for a second. I saw a shit ton of damage. I'm like, is it Cole or Armageddon? I guess Armageddon's way more likely with three mages. <laughs> Didn't think that one through, okay? That's all good. I had to check the locker real quick because I had looked off screen as well. Zeus double blocking, but not good enough. Legendary Arcan Doomsayer. That thing is uh, a tank as well. I quite like that card. And one of our guild members made his a uh, godlike. What's the HP on that? Same, still 316, but it does three uh, evil intent three and battle fatigue two. Oh, okay. Yeah, I would think about that. If I could get my hand on, hands on an epic one, I could make it godlike. Although I don't really have a stone right now, but... Hint, hint, there might be a login event that uh, there's a godlike stone in it. Oh. That'll be nice. It'll make a lot of people happy. Yeah, that's for sure.
Ooh, dangerous death with the sink. A little bit of pushback by the blue side now. Uh, yeah, they should they should be able to get a little bit of uh, a little bit out of this. I have to say, Sebo and Gary, they have some uh, they have some nice cards. Yeah, I'm surprised to come in from Sebo uh, with that horse that he's on. Deceptive. It's true. Sometimes they don't have a horse at all, and people are like, whoa, you have nice cards. No, no, it never happens, because everyone knows who I am. <laughs> oh. And the uh, Judge Alexander just played. And that's uh, Boss Wagner doing a whole one damage to the Ark and Doomsayer. That thing is just like a desperate soul, soul on steroids. It's the first time that I've actually wanted a card from the uh, world boss, whatever you call it. Yeah, this round of uh, Incarnates was really good, I thought. I thought the Feelies was pretty good, but they, they fucked up the typo, and that kind of just pissed me off and made me not want them. Well, it wasn't just you. Noctid pulled out the uh, godlike Darius. I wonder why he's playing it at the very back. Is that the only slot available? I guess so. It looked like that was the only um, actual lane that he could probably get some progress on. So, why the hell would you sank an Ark and Doomsayer? Preserve it from the damage that it would take from the Elven Thunder Mage. But, seriously? It's reflecting one damage. Oh, way. here comes the Magician. First Magician out in uh, Showdown. There goes the Petrify. Let's see which one it's going to take. I want to see it take the Death. That would be epic. Well, that'll be a game changer. All the mages are pretty low on cards except for Bathory. Uh, Nephil, uh, Nephiriel has uh, the most cards on the blue team. But they have a decided advantage right now on the board. Oh, there's Kanum. And there's the arm again. Gary took 24 damage from that armor good. Which is enough to uh, really do a, a game changer and sudden death, or not sudden death, that timeout. Because there's only 13 minutes left now. The magician switches a positive effect or a negative effect from each side, so. If there's a Petrify on your side of the field, it'll give it to the opponent. And if there's, like, a Chosen so One, it can take that. What's that? What's that? Doomsayer as well. They're still going to be taking damage from Arcane Doomsayer as well. Yeah, that's true. Don't see many godlike justices running around. No, I haven't actually seen any. Oh, there's one. the first I've seen. You don't enhance that shit. You just get lucky. Yeah, right. So Bathory is down to 46 HP. And Doomsayer are going to keep you go. doing damage. Gar Garby's down to 37. Oh, 
Byron. Too bad the ma I haven't seen the magician do a ton of work. It's always just the number one target because you have to. Anything that can revert debuffs, you have to take care of it. I think that the uh, wheel is much better than the magician. I have a godlike magician personally, just because I can't stand the priest rush, and it's helped me immensely, but I'll be getting the wheel for sure, one way or another. Oh, the the wheel has to be on everybody's target as far as a card to get as far as tarot. Yeah, it's a pretty strong tarot card. Godlike, nimble, haha, <laughs> good game, rushers. <laughs> right? Like, I'm just gonna swift raid. No, you're not! <laughs> I'm just gonna chosen. No, you're not! The wheel gets rid of all That's positive gonna be out effects July, and negative effects. Right? What's that? That's going to be out in about July for the wheel. We'll see. Hint, hint. It might be out sooner than that. Gotcha. I'm ready regardless. Oh, are you buying me the wheel, are you? Nah, I keep, I keep Amethyst saved up. Right. Yeah, my buddy Cheese has uh, two times uh, saved up for the wheel. Uh, when I got him his uh, his Maya, his Awakened Maya, he hasn't spent uh, the Amethyst on anything since then. He's a hoarder. <laughs> Nothing wrong with being a hoarder. Yeah, it looks like the blue team's gonna be taking this one. Yeah, with Garb down to 22 health. That uh, Doomsday are really doing a lot of work. Which I'm surprised with three mages, the Doomsday hasn't been petrified yet. This will probably go down to a uh, timeout, but it's not gonna be close. Bathory down to 15 health now with the sink. I'd like Emery. I think this was a good match to watch. It's been pretty back and forth. Yeah, it's been it has been good because there has been a a push on both sides in the second. That's another godlike set. It probably got returned from a previous Alexander. Ugh, Lori, gross. Wow, just a blender station on the justice. Or it can be troublesome not taking care of. What class do you run, Death? Mage, primary, uh, ranger, secondary. Ranger gonna be so deadly with the wheel. 
Yeah. As long as you're not spiking. <laughs> Zero attack on the wheel, isn't it? Zero attack, it's like 10 health, I believe. Uh, Godlike, it's nimble. Legendary, it's not nimble. But everything else is the same. There's so many tarot walls, it's funny. I find that odd. Yeah, it is a good point. I have a history of getting the crap ones. Like, I got the tower and I got the hermit, which both I don't use. Yeah, I got the hermit. I skipped on it. And then I got lucky with the world and got a godlike one, so I can't complain. I had to enhance mine. But I'm not complaining because it's worth it. Yeah, no kidding. I was going to enhance it regardless. I'm like, oh, I got a godlike. Ah, I don't use enhance. <laughs> I haven't gotten a godlike uh, tarot card yet from a pack, or from a, from, you know, the chest. A box. Yeah, that was my first one. And another push, this time by the uh, red team. It's just back and forth. Good Armageddon really kind of gave him a shot. They really got to make a move, though, and taking down some hit points off of the heroes. Or alone. gaining hit points. The Raddy's out with his... Uh, he's the only one, I think, above half health. Yeah, Zeus just not doing enough, and neither is that uh, Succubus. Although 3 damage is a lot. 12 damage a turn. And Void Step. So, uh... It could turn around. Four minutes left. Plenty of time. It's going to help. Uh, just depends on if the uh, blue team's going to play any more heavenly help. How are you doing? Uh. Station worker here. Are you going to say hello? Are you going to watch the Mindy Project? No. Interesting they chose to think in Augusta. There's that uh, three damage a turn from the uh, Succubi. Are you going to watch? Ew. That's just so gross. I started watching that while ago. Raw, that yeah. could help give him a little bit more of an advantage. Yeah, I know. That's why I don't like it. Like a serial killer hunting serial killers. Well, I know. Well, I know. But still, it's been a lot better. Who's that? It's like the guy that he's kind of trying to catch. Oh. Oh dear. That was kind of frightening. Oh. Just like. Just Jones, Jones, and Blue team just needs murders. to eat time, really. What's that? Blue team just needs to eat time. They've got the hit point again. Yeah, just uh, two minutes left. I'm just trying to avoid 
You gotta give me something and soon. Or if I can't afford another public relations disaster. That's uh, eight more damage. A little battery down to nine HP. Jesus, Maria, that's not gonna happen. Wow. It's a good final push for the red team. Yeah, if there's more time, it'd be interesting to see what happens. God, like yeah. Queen of the Zodiac. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's, uh, it's called Aquatomal Fusion. Like, I'm going to be a punk. That's like the dude's thing. Yeah, they're pretty known as, um, you go No memory flashes here. No little lost form. So what do you think next? Oh, fine to finish. Um, let's see. You got gutter funk. Number one team on the left. What about Gentleman's Club and Gutter Fund? Gentleman's Club and Gutter Fund? On the left, bottom bracket. Crimson Knights and what? Or Gentleman's Club and Daughter Fund. Yeah, that's the one I was talking about. Got yeah. um, Addington. Yeah, we'll watch it because it's Spike. Yeah. Spike, Spike for Spike. Both of them using the three Ranger. Want answers and I want them now. Oh, that room. Incredible at what? Hello? Hi there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I heard you. Here we go. I have to get some action. Yes, I hear you. Well, call me back when you have better reception. Be swift raids. A little bit of uh, military charge. See if it'll take up some. Probably not. Oh, there's a crit. Need another crit. And I was wrong. There's the double crit to take out top. Three rangers take up four guys. Doubtful. First blood almost always wins. Yeah. 
apart from the Zeno. Come on, crit. No, four HP left for me. They use three in the rage for And wow, we're on two. That's game. Well, about a six cards, and now what you can do against uh, four people. There's Myth my raid. Go for it. No, not at all. It's about an 80 HP advantage. 87. Please. Looking for a double crit to have any chance here. There's one crit. Oh, didn't get the other. Red team just can't can't get anything strung together. Why do people use the hangman? For the extra attack. Why not use line work? Not bad, I guess. It could be you because then it's a wall as well. That's true. That's the first godlike hand. Here's the line where. Scenarios teams What the hell happened to Baba Beluga? One crit and uh, Baba's dead? No, not anymore. Yeah. 
Bro, that Lori made it all the way through. Yeah. I don't know what the hell happened. I want to see a crit though. Make it interesting. Oh, well, it would have killed him. Can they not take care of the Lord? Oh, they're hoping there looks like Barkus between Barkus and Judge Martin. They should be able to kill Lori. Right, gotcha. Didn't see the Martin. Someone once said it's easier dealing with other people's problems than your own. Oh, that uh, Gorkus cleave. And Bab is up to 52 HP, so this is a game. Oh, that's nice. You don't see that often. You don't see a cleave on Gork that often. And they can't do anything about Gork besides disinfo repulse, which they don't have. So sweaty. Yeah. Carry a body. That's game. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, he's back. Varkas is pretty scary at 1333. Yeah, I was kind of hoping that at an awakened he had gone plus two. But you give it plus two? Yeah, it doesn't, eh? No, it'd get, well, I, I, I was hoping they would have gone plus two, plus two, as far as plus two attack, plus two life when something died, but then he gets it. Yeah. I can't wait for the birdie that gives um, plus two, plus six. Oh, uh, wing down? Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be pretty dirty. And Karamu down to 4 HP. See, I've never seen a god like Nefreta. I don't understand why. I think she only gains hit points. Which is exactly what she needs. She gets one attack too. Okay. No problem is insurmountable, not when you have the most accessible evidence software in my name. All good need to go away. Yeah, I, I, it's not enough to really justify. 
put that photo as a flight from prison and do just fine with it. For now, at least, the code of carrying is unbroken. Okay. Is that over here? Yes. Yeah, Awakened Silva is interesting with the accursed on everything. Good for Riley. Well done, Dex. Very good for Riley. You choose a match. I'm looking at the same one you're looking at. Which is? Uh, top right here. Abyss and Massive Headwind? Yeah, with uh, Mind Jam and Nocted. Yeah. Think about I mean, when you when you want to enhance something to awaken, you really try to get something that's going to give you the biggest impact that's available. You know what I mean? I.e., not Fenris. Yeah, there's some a uh, uh, cross server that made Fenris. A, a priest made Fenris. He looks like a hairless rat. Yeah, I hate the uh, model. I don't like it at all. Angry That was dead. So There's a lot of chatter as well about Chief Warden Ariella that awakens and she goes nimble. What, the nimble? Yeah. Well, she it, she's a double-edged sword, you know what I mean? How do you figure? Well, because she can end up pulling things closer to you than you would want them. If you, oh, like Ralk. Unintentionally, oh right? Something like that. Ralk or the Justice or something dangerous. Uh, went down to LP. Yeah. Head to the left, that's what happened. Psycho tell you what. He's slipping though. Is he just for this episode or is he for multiples? No, he's not. Alright, that's show again. He's slipping like crazy. Like, Hello. Yes, I did. Are you making some bacon sandwiches? I am. They're going pretty quick. Ah! Bacon sandwiches.
We'll be right back. We're going to see about a bacon sandwich. That sounds good. What kind of a child did this kid have? This is murder. Well, let's see if this Gary Rivera can do anything with that. The blue team was able to take care of the Kanum, so had to buy him a little time. Nice play with the Alexandra and the Roth. Bank on the Odin. It's going to hurt. Yeah, the red side has to hope that the blue side doesn't have an armor. Doesn't look like it. Between Healer White and Archangel Gabriel, the blue side should be able to keep all their stuff alive for a bit longer.
Doesn't look like blue team has much of an answer for Odin yet. That was a really yummy breakfast. That bacon's always good. Mm, bacon cheese tomato sandwich. That Odin. Odin's stirring up trouble right now. Yeah, the captain's doing a good job of kind of holding him back, but he's going to continue to get, a, get more attack and more health to be able to hit the hero, so... And here we see an Ark and Doomsayer again. Probably the same one. You should start seeing more of that card in fours. Powerful forest card, that's for sure. Especially with Freya out, holy shit, it just beefs up so fast. That awakened captain tanking the Odin. <laughs> How the hell did Luanu get down to 20 health? That happened before. He had, um, had a Konoma in his face for a bit. Ah. Oh, yeah, and then they used the, um, the Caitlyn to get rid of it. They had to use, um, they had to use, um, Four cards. They had to use Lumineers, uh, Legionnaire, and Skyri Rivera. Oh, wow. One of the deadliest combos for 4v4 really is if you team up uh, the Hierophant and Lady Neferata. Oh yeah, it just grows so fast. I wish I had the Hierophant. The Elephant, as I say. <laughs> The High Priestess is actually doing a lot of work for Luan Lu. 5 HP a turn is uh, quite a lot. Yeah, and it's doing its job right now. And Storian's Kanam, so there's the heals there. It's going to come down to how much damage the Ark and Doomsayer can do. Really? Yeah, because the, the red team doesn't really have much of a hit point advantage. They don't, they don't have a hit point advantage anymore, actually. It's very, very close. It's within 10. And the red team's going to do something with the High Priestess, especially with less than two minutes to go. Yeah, Blue's just getting the HP advantage now with Dorian healing up and uh, Luanu healing up. If 
thanking him with help, heavenly help. Just uh, really boosted up Dory. Dorian pretty much back to full now. But it looks like the blue team's going to win this one. Very close game, though. Nice comeback, actually. They just had, like, this defensive stance in their own end with, like, 16 creatures, and that's all they needed, and they just did some pain damage. Ark and Doomsayer MVP again. Not over yet, though. Kalista with Heavenly. No, it's not over yet, but... I think indirect damage um, gets forgotten about too often. Especially in Guild Showdown. Yep. There's that Doomsayer doing more damage. And full heal up. There's a Gargahel. Oh, that's it. Yeah, blue team's got this. Another good match. Most definitely. And the battle ends before the time runs out. So down to the final eight here. What are you thinking? Shall we stick with our uh, massive head wound who we've been watching uh, the whole... Wait a second. Yeah, we got Massive Head Wound, Infinity next, and then uh, Gutterfunk's going to be a good, good match as well, I bet, with Crimson Knight. Yeah, I'm going to watch got that. two Gutterfunks and two Crimson. I'm going to watch that first just to see if there's a spike out, because you always want to watch spike first, otherwise it's done. Right. Uh, so four versus... It's a power match. And four versus three. How did they get so far with three people? I'll probably getting some buys. No shows. Not power, power. There's Spike. On the bottom right bracket. Oh, Gods to Obey and Crimson Knight. Alright, I'm watching the bottom right bracket. See the spike. But it's spike versus power, so it'll still be a good match, though. Spike versus anti. Oh, even better. I like a good, I like a good anti. Pulls out the refuge. The uh, wall of lost souls right away. Just leaving one lane open. See, I like to uh, I like to make sure Refuge just played in lane two or three because a wall of the lost souls can still be taken care of by uh, by uh, um can't think of her name. Alice or Frenzy? Uh, yeah, Alice King. Yeah, King and Mystery Alice. Looks like the ante is pretty damn successful right now. Yeah, I don't see blue having much of a 
chance. Not if they can keep uh, refuge and a poison swamp down. Saint, how many um, split pages you have at the moment? Twenty-three. Okay. Are you doing just one gold giveaway or five? I'm doing uh, one for every ten people. Okay. Time for Byron to spam his Twitch accounts. <laughs> yeah, I have like twenty because I, every time I forgot my password, I kept making one. Let's say I have a lane going here. Here's, the ho here's hoping for a no block on the Trojan. Ha! Oh, and it. Oh, he's bringing the uh, the cure spell in an ante. Interesting. I guess that's worth it. I guess. Uh, rejuvenation. Yeah. Well, I mean, at Epic, it's ten hit points. That can be a can be a difference maker. It's very true. I'm giving it to Anti right now here. Yeah, it looks like they got a pretty good foot. Go, Trump Army, go. Poison Swamp opening up soon. Oh, wow. You don't see the Temperance very often. Did you? <laughs> no. No, you don't. Were you looking for me? What? Were you looking for me? Yeah. Gonna watch TV for a bit? No. Yeah. Well, I'm done and we can do something. What? Then I'll finish up and we can do something. Yeah. We can go out. Did you eat? We faced a spike. Um, oh, okay. Last week in RTS, that was rather interesting. They, uh, I think they were running like two, two warriors and two rangers, but they, their main thing was just putting all the buffs on Jerax and Cleave. Who over there, who um, are looking, my parents want to do renovations. So they're looking and seeing if they can take out a wall. It almost worked. But not quite. I don't expect you to watch Dexter. Well, I don't expect it was against us, Dexter. and we were power, so... I don't expect you to watch Dexter. <laughs> yeah, I think I rated it one star. In the block. Grin. Hey, yeah, I've watched, like, all the seasons of Dexter. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm starting to watch Happy Ending. Yeah, what do you think? Funny. It is funny. Like you, fun. <laughs> Gotta get rid of Yumi and uh, Town Prince in the bottom lane. They're holding on to a ton of cards here. If they can get a lane, they should have enough buffs and cards so they can kill oh, yeah, for sure. one of the players. Oh, that is just pathetic. Three damage call? Why would you do that? That was bad. That was a bad play. It's one of the few cards I would hold on to in uh, a situation like this. When you have six cards or seven cards. 
I mean, because they could have easily just put out a card and buffed it and then used call. They would have had a nice little return. Yeah, put something in the bottom lane and the swift raid and the boom, bam, boom. You got a dead guy. Oh, there's a nice open lane. Looking for another call. Couple swift raids. Couple encourages. Call. Any books? There we go. That's good enough. Looks like uh, bottom should be dead with a crit here. No crit. No crit. No death. How are you, Black Knight? I'm going out blind date tonight because I'm a small thing with South East Side Roger. Oh, spot! Both of them are taking it. I'm going to say, like, that. 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 You're welcome to change it. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you trying to get comfy over there? Yeah. No. I don't get too upset, Black. Looks like this one's over there, hey? Yeah, I don't see Blue coming back from this one. Had to fight a marble gong. Marble gargoyle. Go well. <laughs> Dane Kaiser, uh, Shin Kaiser pulling out of God's Plate Petrol. Shin Kaiser has a lot of HP now, considering he was down to like nothing. <laughs> There's something. Not good enough, though. Another sore I know. What? What? Are you Sarah? No. Oh, and I'm guessing you're not. Because you're only saying I do like her. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, when I get nervous, I turn into Blanche from the Golden Girl. No. Hi. Hey. So you're waiting for Blind Day 2? I was, but I think you're like a half an hour.
Looks like massive head wounds taking out Infinity right now. You just the, uh, exactly. Yes, wait, what's that? Just a quick second. Oh, I got a secret gag. What? Maybe they all have kind of eyes. Fucking college years on my phone. I'm just going to get a I'm going to get a I'm going to get a I'm going to get a i You still there? Yeah, I'm still here. Oh, which match are you watching? Uh, we're watching the same one. Okay. That arm again was deadly, and another Ark and Doomsayer out. Dorian. Dorian just put godlike eight heavenly help on it. Yeah, that's pretty strong. And there's finally a Petrify on the Ark of Doomsayer after three games. Somebody finally did it. Figured out, hey, wait a second, this guy is killing us. Let's just leave it alone. <laughs> Chris, 84, with the godlike Praetorian. I'm sure he's going to be enhancing that pretty soon. Yeah, I'm surprised it's not awakened, honestly. See lots of bane on lots of damage on both sides. Yeah. Bane and I think with the bane power of cards. Power of cards are available nowadays. You really bane is really just on showdowns is untouchable. It looks like the Doomsayer is back. I'm rooting for uh, Dorian and whatnot. We've just been watching them the whole time and they've been doing quite well. Yeah. Dorian played his own godlike Praetorian. What's with the godlike Praetorians? I don't know. Interesting, they chose the pad on Kalista over the Doomsayer. Maybe a mistake, maybe not. We'll find out. God like Skyrim. Doomsayer doing more damage. Cleese to cure it up. Pet on the battle. Battle. Battle Abyss. They're going to have to do something about that undead King Bill. Eh, Cleese will take care of it.
if uh, doesn't get wrecked by the Smasher Rock. We'll see. Could be a... But again, so much heals out. Pet on Kalista. Oh, the elephant. Good combo to have with um, Undead King Bell out as well. This is true. Black Knight, why aren't you talking? Do you break your microphone again? Oh, I feel sorry for you. He's not in the mood to talk. I understand. That's, that's understandable. Zeus in the world to do some major damage. I always try and play the world top in case of Zeus. You know what I mean? So you get the wound and yeah. then the extra damage. Exactly. It's unfortunate that that Smasha has HH on, a heavenly help on. That's Julianas, who really cares? <laughs> yeah, Bale doing a lot of work, though. So. Here, fence uh, powering up a little bit. Yeah, the godlike like Tesla's and godlike world and godlike Zeus is just just deadly. Straight destruction. out the world. Take out the Zeus. Gonna try and push back here. Juliana was his VIP zero who was winning postseasons for quite a while. Until they transferred the account to someone okay. else. The Hierophant deadly though. Should be. Yeah. Just one shot and everything in the lane. Damage. See, that's better placement of the Zeus in the world. Yes. You gotta think the little things. That's what uh, win you games. Blue team is getting a nice amount of zombies to resurrect. There goes the purge and the Zeus. I give huge field advantage to the blue team, but uh, their HP is just not so high. And they have the advantage, but it still seems rather shaky.
There's an elephant out for the other side. Oh, that guy looks godlike. Oh, blood tax three. Yes, very nice. Not as nice as a 20 bloody to 12, though. No. The only thing I don't like about it is that it's 4-way and you can just DB it, but otherwise it's a pretty fantastic card. Yeah, that, that's a disadvantage, but I mean, can you imagine though if it wasn't? It'd just, just be too beastly. Yeah, you'd have to disinfo that shit or time to die it. Because it's just 44 crit, Jesus. It's just, it just camps there forever because you can't, you can't kill it. Yeah, no, you try to kill it, you kill everything around it. And then you put Vel in there, and it still doesn't die. Right. It's a nice sink on uh, Caitlyn. I'm pretty sure that's the highest attack I've seen the elephant before. Well, the red team can't do anything about that because there's no mages. Yeah, there, there's one mage, never mind. And I'll never get in repulse range. Hi, Crow Crow. You don't see many awakened decans. Well, that's the first one I've seen. I mean, as far as I know, I have the only Emery's. Yeah, nobody on our cluster has Emery's, but there's a guy that has uh, Ecan. I think Emery's is just quite hard to get as well. And then who does that? Oh, I did it because I was the only one I had when I made, when I had the opal at the very beginning, like the first gold rush. I would make a Nimrus if I got it, but every time I open up a Champions pack, it seems like they want to give me uh, Dragon Hunter Benson. How many do you have? I had five. Christ almighty. No, I have one because I sold four of them. But... Eh, two is okay, I mean... Gotta do something about that sensei before Spartacus heals up there. I have 33. Oh my god, that Hierophant. Oh man. Get rid of the Vel and win game. Now it's about to get interesting. Oh, there's oh. the purge. It looked like um, Demon Hunter tried to take tank the purge. <laughs> yeah, it did. Take a touch on the other here, Finn. Hello, Hados.
Danica out a little too late. This has this has to be a stall time now. Yeah. Looking to get that Hierophant through for one crit and then change it up. We'll see if uh, the red team has anything for lane two. I'm sure they do. Something with a sank. Oh, that works too. But Amaris is going to crush that. Yeah, it's not going to stop Amaris. Yeah, I've got a god like Amaris and an awakened one. <laughs> Just want one. Yeah? Would you Go. awaken it? Yeah, I would. It's a scary ass card. Well, it's, it's mainly because of the Sunder and all the double damage it does to specific just units. Everything. Just, just makes it a super card. Meridoc saying that there's a Jill and Chris are still VIP zero, and uh, Spartacus and Sarah are VIP ten or something. I don't know what he's talking about. Maybe it's a different team. It says two VIP zeros and two VIP tens. I'm guessing that Sarah is a VIP zero. Pretty crazy to be at P zero and have a godlike command. Looks like Infinity won that one. I didn't think they would. I didn't think they would either, but that was a good another good match. The other match is still going on. I don't understand why that one ended first. This one's gotta end here shortly. I don't even see a timer. Well, I guess they wait until the turn's done. Quite possibly. Apparently Sarah is a VIP 10 without a horse. Nice. Two, two power matches, whichever one you want to watch. I feel like Nario, Plumber, Babaluga, and Macros are going to crush. So the other match would be better to watch. Power start off with a godlike Siva. Yeah, no problem. Just a godlike Siva. <laughs> I don't think I see the godlike lords yet. Um, yeah, I've seen them before.
I think I'm going to pop in Harley Quinn in my showdown. I've never, I've never used that card. It's a rare card. Very, very unused. I'm surprised to see a lock of warriors in power, as they're pretty freaking strong in force. Yeah, if they if they've got three calls, then it's definitely worth running a warrior in a four, for even for power. I mean, I got three. Two of them are godlikes, so it's pretty deadly. Oh, you made two of them gods? Yeah. I had a lot of fire rubies from the uh, compensation. Eight percent doesn't seem like much of a return, but it's a, it's 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 enough. Yeah. Uh, it, it gets it done. Wow, they sure got rid of that M, uh, Eakin quick. more Bane and Zeus damage. What's next for Awakened Beasts? Goblins should be next. Oh yeah, all their incarnate stuff have been. If you look at the 1.0 list on cards in your guide. Yeah, it's an order. Yeah. So goblin, ogres, and beasts are last. Uh, I know a lot of people that are waiting to wait to awaken Gork. Yeah, I was just gonna say I can't wait for ogres.
think on Ragnar is going to cause a lot of havoc. High power with the awakened thunder arch mage. What's that you say? High power played an awakened high, uh, elven thunder arch mage. And then the armor destroys it. Interesting uh, choice to put Darkbringer top, I guess, trying to finish off the Fenris, but that's a risky move because Fenris could not die. Very risky. Guess it paid off. <gasps> I've yet to see a god like Artemis. Doesn't really need the upgrade. Yeah, there's a guy on our cross server that has a god like Artemis as well. I can't wait till they update the uh, season reward so I can get that uh, cool rainbow background. When's that? supposed to take place. That uh, should be in the next couple months. Round, round about. I'm thinking May or June. Probably June. They okay. still have the... Go ahead. Far off. Are they going to put it... Put in the... They're going to put in the Angel uh, Champion packs here relatively soon as well? Well, they, they don't have them on the Chinese server, do they? Well, I mean, we're running on, we've been running on the Demon Champion packs for postseason now for four months, almost five. I'm pretty sure the Chinese server still has them. Correct me if I'm wrong, somebody, but uh, that's what I, I saw 50% something. So it, it could be Angels, but I have a feeling it's still Demons. Flying Fenris for the win. Holy crap, they're out now. Token just totally told me, totally, uh, totally got to me. It's, uh, the champion packs are angels now. Really? Yeah. I gotta check this. I guess I gotta stop watching the match I'm and just serious. check. I don't believe you. I'm dead serious. I'm dead serious, man. They must have done it on Wednesday. Had to have done it Wednesday. Oh. Well, shit. Because now I want, you know, I want a god like Michael. Yeah, 
I don't want a Raphaela no, though. You no, can it's shoot me in the fight for. You can shoot me in the face if I get a Raphael, please. Oh no. Which is probably what I'll get, you know, a Raphael. Or another Maximus or something other I don't need. Probably. Mm, two armas and two turns. Reflect on that Valen so much. But yeah, there's only one card I want from that pack. I can just have Z Michael. <laughs> 